Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it is a beautiful um, Wednesday morning here in Austin, Texas. This is day 9-11 of the Three Plus Minutes of Planks Challenge. And as always, I am filled with gratitude. Thoughts on my mind this morning. Uh, last week, I had a good friend of mine um, ask me a question. Uh, she asked me, how do you feel about putting your whole life on social media? And uh, <laughs> the question blew me away uh, because four years ago, I would have told you it was the craziest thing in the world. Uh, uh, but I'm gonna, this is sort of how I responded to her. Four years ago, I was in a low point in my life and I was trying to figure me out. Came to a point where I was realizing that I had to hold myself accountable. Came to a point that I realized that I'd been lying to myself about some things and was insecure. So I came to this point, um, and part of it is because I, I do music, and I said, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go social media because it scares me, completely scares me, because I knew that if I would do it, then it would make me feel very, very vulnerable. And that's something that I never really did or knew how to do at one point. Now that's the beginning of the journey. And so I did it and uh, made a lot of mistakes along the ways, <laughs> still make mistakes, still a flawed human being. But in the midst of it, of the four years, I found, uh, found God, found friends. Unfortunately, I lost friends. Or should I say fortunately at times too. But I found me in, a, in, in an interesting way. Uh, I found purpose. I found that I found ways to help others in ways that I never thought I could. Um, it was just sort of an amazing, it's been an amazing journey. The things that have been important to me have been first and foremost, my faith. Uh, talking about mental health, especially with men, most specifically with African-American men, uh, discipline, um, living out your dreams. Those have been really, really important to me. And those are the things that I talk about the most. Now, it doesn't make me the most popular. Uh, it doesn't make me, um, uh, it, it, it doesn't make me the greatest thing since sliced bread. All it does, it makes me, me. I like to say that you are seeing the authentic me. And a lot of it, those, you know, I have some friends that say, man, I, I love your, I love what you say. You're so positive. And I appreciate that. And there's some truth to that. But let me tell you this. A lot of it is just me following God's lead. A lot of me is just saying, hey, today I'm just going to be the best version of myself. And so every day I, I do or say something. It's the, the idea that I'm hoping that I'm, my vulnerability helps others. Uh, I'm hoping that you see the, dis the discipline and commitment that I put to being the best version of me. I hope that you see God in me. And I hope that in time you see the best version of yourself. So that's just the idea and the words that I said to her. Now, as always, be blessed today and every day. Talk to you soon. Peace.